the majority of the radiation which reaches planet Earth from the Sun is in the visible light spectrum, ranging from 4 tenths to 8 tenths of a micron, with its peak at 600 nanometers or 6 tenths of a micron. The energy which leaves planet Earth and radiates back out into space is of much lower intensity and thus is in the infrared region of the electromagnetic spectrum with wavelengths of 4 to 40 microns peaking in the range of 8 to 10 microns. If all of this radiation left planet Earth and radiated out into space, there would be no greenhouse effect and the average temperature of our planet would be minus 15 degrees Celsius, too cold to sustain life as we know it. If, on the other hand, all of this heat were retained, the planet would be 10 degrees warmer than it currently is, 10 degrees Celsius, a temperature which has not been reached in the past millions of years. There are greenhouse gases in the atmosphere which absorb some of this outgoing energy so that it does not radiate into space. And it is as it is randomly redispersed in the atmosphere, some of it makes it back to Earth where it warms the planet. 90% of the outgoing thermal radiation is reabsorbed by greenhouse gases and life on Earth depends on this.